And hello there everyone, welcome back. I am the Bog Mod. We're playing the Europa Universalis 4. When I'm at war with the Dutch. My goal to take much Dutch land. And it shouldn't prove hard. I've got an impressively powerful fleet. The French army is unmatched in the world. Speaking of the French army. At 400,000 soldiers. I think we can all agree. But the French have a lot of troops. Oh, hello. Hello, rebel. I'm gonna build a fortress here. In Brisgau. Alright, next stop there, I guess. Now, I mostly just want to clear up this, uh, this chunk of land. Dispute borders? Really? Oh, have they? I think they might have been forced completely to the New World. Huh. Well, that changes things. Yes, Friesland is no longer in Europe. So I could take this land. It's good land. Ooh, it's good land. Do I want that land? No. I went into this war wanting all of this. I'm demanding Antigua without occupying any forts in the area. Well, come on, guys. Get to it. That's what I need you to do. There we are. So this rich, wonderful land here in the west, or the east, Marissa, there we go, all of that now properly good in cord, yeah, and once again the nobility are like, where's my land? Give me land! There you are, nobles. Have some overseas holdings. Yeah, you say you give me that, but I want, I want a little bit more. Right, what if I wanted everything but Antigua? Mm, you'd give me that. It's pretty decent. Kind of happy with that, actually. Of course, if I were so inclined, I could also take up just devour all of this except for Antigua. Huh. 
You know what? Oh. Mmm. That was tasty land. Oh, that is tasty Dutch land. I mean, I've had some tasty land in my time. But that stuff really fit the bill. And now the nobility is again grumpy. There you guys go. You have Venetian lands. 15%. Eh. And once again, Alsace is like, give me some land back. Blah, blah, blah. Nope. It's mine. Mine now. Mine forever. This is the way of things. Ooh, what war is this? Oh no! Arquid has died. Bohemia and Siena. What war is this? The defender in the second Bohemia crusade against the Ottomans. You didn't invite me to the crusades? For shame, Bohemia. But I'll let you do your thing. Before I see about doing... My thing. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't need to be your friend. This is good. I'm happy with this, more or less. This is the capital of the Dutch West Indies. Their, their colony of Holland? Where is Holland these days? Holland! Holland, everybody! Oh, that's what the Dutch ran after. Huh. Go figure. Oh no. Oh, well. Yeah, those rebels won't last long. Cleveland Separatists. Yeah, as long as they stay away from my lands. Costa. Corruption's low. That's being fine. More money. Call you. Ooh, what is this? Because he's well advised. Get an empowered council. Uh, giving us prestige for a while. Yeah, I'll go with that. And expand the power of French Canada. And spend more diplomatic points. Mm -hmm. Just do a little, a little swap like that. It's cost me some points and development. No. Oh. Hmm. I just don't understand why you'd ever really go through with this. It just, it just doesn't seem worthwhile. Unless you're doing some sort of like special culture flip trick. Then I could understand it. Um, but yeah, it's like culture, no. No, 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 no. Uh, I'm going to just go with my usual. Should be good. Next year we can finish off that. 
Ah, they can deal with that, I think. California's fine. Oregon's fine. French Canada's building a tendril towards the Pawnee, which is also fine. Oh no! Flurry has died. Anyone cheap? Not especially. I'll take you. Because you can improve relations nicely. It's a fairly even fight, Fond du Luc. At least even at the moment. Russia, do you owe me favors? Not yet. Hmm. What's your opinion of me? Oh yeah, the unlawful territory. Definitely going to stay my friend. Brandenburg, 19 years of age. Let's see. Now it's a succession war between France and Bohemia. I would so take that war. And then I'd have my very own little Brandenburg to call my own. Wouldn't that be nice? Let's see what's the from Bohemia. German alchemist, first porcelain. Shadowware is losing value. All right. Ooh, oh, next year. Next year we're gonna see the new, the newest ideas coming out. Oh yes, yes, yes. The final institution. Enlightenment. Oh no, the Hollandy people are getting upset at me. Oh, and it looks like I just have another. Ah, manufactories. I own the manufactories. Assuring recent uprising, mild winter, for enemies. There we are, the Enlightenment. <gasps> I think it spawned in my territory. Let's change everything, gain 100. Points. Let's see. The last century has seen a rationalism and a empiricism getting an ever increasing popularity among the great minds of the age. Letters, publications, or coffee houses, kings! Because we all know that's where kings hang out. Scientists, philosophers, and literatures. The merits of tolerance. Eh, it's got some perks. The scientific method. Eh, it's better than our guessing before. And the spreading of enlightenment ideals to all of humanity. I'm definitely trying to spread. French ideals to all of humanity. Mm. Way and map the world so that we can better understand the laws that govern the things around us. But it's been in Montferrat. Alright, so. So. Yeah. Aha! Ooh! Both the Enlightenment and the Renaissance. We're birthed in Montferrat. But it's mine. I've got the first. And it looks like it's spreading everywhere. What spreads it? Universities. Ooh. Full innovative ideas. Capital District 20 higher scientists or philosopher. What do I have? I have a treasurer. Guess that'll do. So there we are. We are looking at the next age is upon us. And the covered way. It was military tech 24. We can build fortresses now. But I'm of course going to be saving up for um, 
taking that as my my, tr my tr um, where is it? Embracing it. Cultural conversion cost minus twenty five percent again. Not something I'm going to be leaping ahead to do, but good to be aware of. Hmm. I'm with Afghanistan, guaranteeing the independence of Malwa. Meh. Hmm. Terra Australia. I guess I could have. I guess I could have. Ooh, hello, Malandi. Oh, interesting. Interesting. I also find it kind of funny that no one's bothered with this land. Oh, I guess there's other places we need to go. Places to be. To Salzburg, Brabant. You know, I feel like it might be time. It will very soon be time to, to deal with this chunk of, of Italy. Castile, Mantua, Brabant, Salzburg. Brabant and Denmark could be brought into the war. Or, if I wait... Oh, Castile is probably because they are the... Yes. All right, you know what? Depending on how... Oh, Bohemia. Oh, Castile. Wait, wait. Is Castile involved in the war? Oh, they are. But it looks like, without French armies to give them that extra oomph, they just don't have what it takes. No matter. No matter. How is our young king doing? Our Dauphin, Louis de Valois, is alright. He's definitely alive. How's it spreading? Half a percent a month, eh? Because we have a university. Hmm. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What if... Just giving advisor. With his head points. So wait, wait. Natural scientist. The scientist. And they're point two five. Capital District 20 province. Point There we are. Yeah, I think that'll work out. So now, there we are, nearly a point a month. And you know what? I think I'm going to push it along a little. Because we can make France... Or we can make Paris truly the, the a, a glorious place to be. There we are. The Enlightenment is finally present in our glorious capital. Well, yeah. Paris of Montfrey, and it'll spread from there. Point five month. Perfect. Wonderful. 
Right, time to save a cash. Anyhow, I want to take a little break here, I think. We'll come back soon. We will... We might get involved in this war, actually. If I were to bring in another group of my armies nearby, I could undoubtedly launch a war. On the other hand, depending on how much Castile gets caught up in things... Glory. Cool. Denmark and Brandenburg could help me against Mantua, Brabant, Salzburg, and Castile. Castile, of course, the only real opponent in all of this. Where's my fleet? Alright, oh, you're there. Presia. Stop that nobility. That's a bad nobility. Um, let's see. what. How many troops do I have in this chunk of the world? 200,000 men. Wow, 200,000. Just there. I think that's probably enough to handle a war. I'll think about it. There's no rush after all. It's not like the the Pope is going anywhere, now that he's out of Rome at least. Anyhow, thank you all for watching. We'll see you soon for more.